No Film School's coverage of NAB 2019 is brought to you by SERP, simple portable motion control. Rode Microphones, the choice of today's creative generation. Black Magic Design, creating revolutionary solutions for film, post-production, and television. Hi guys, this is Oakley from No Film School. I'm at NAB 2019, and I'm here at the Whipster booth with the founder, Rolo, who's gonna tell us uh, a little bit about Whipster and what is new this year at NAB. Sure thing. So new at NAB is a whole lot of stuff about audio, but first of all, I'll just tell you what the product's about. Webster is a, a product in the cloud where you can share content with either collaborators or, or reviewers and then they can make notes directly on top of the video. What we find is that our users and customers are sometimes being able to produce three times the amount of video in the same time frame, which is insane. And what they can do is either produce more content on the same budget or with that free time they can go for a bike ride or have a latte. <laughs> and, uh, so we've, we've been doing really, really well with video for a long time. Um, we've got a lot of the media companies, a lot of big corporates, and a ton of freelancers, production companies. We've got customers in pretty much every American town. It's so cool. And, um, and what we're launching here is the ability to do everything we've done with video now on audio files. And all the podcasters who have been harassing us for quite a few months are now cheering quietly in the background. Uh, and what you can do is, We've not seen any other product to be able to do this other than the social thing on SoundCloud where you say, oh, nice drop, bro, you know, that type of thing. Uh, so what we've done is we've made frame accurate uh, comments happen on audio files. And not only that, but you can also upload the super high res audio file. We compress an MP3 for playback. People make all their notes and reply to each other and create a to-do list. And then once it's approved, you can then deliver the high res. So in one user experience, you've engaged all the people around that piece of audio and you've delivered it. So that is launching here at NAB. Very cool. So if you're a filmmaker who's maybe working, you know, with sound design or a score, um, is it, can you, how easy is it to integrate the audio review with the video review that you already have? How, do, how does a filmmaker work in that sense? Sure thing. So. What we've, what we've turned into is a, is a content review platform versus a video review platform. You can upload images, PDFs, audio files, and videos all into the collaborative workspace. All your teammates can see it all. And then you can, you can create collections to share out for review. And what that means is you might select two videos, five audio tracks, a script, and some images. And then you share that as a collection to review. And that becomes one link that goes out. Everyone can make their notes on all the different pieces by clicking through them. And all of that comes back to the team. The cool thing there as well is that in the team you might have different people doing audio or video or design or something. All those notes come back to the people who need to do the job as a to-do list. It takes, a, it takes a little shot on the video, it takes that part of the audio, and it shows you where all that's happening and puts it into a, a to-do list to tick off. And when you do, it then asks you to upload the next version. And then you've got version stacking, and then you deliver, and it's all in one place. So it's just, it's just streamlining a whole lot of stuff that used to be five different products and now it's just one tidy product. You're here inside the Microsoft booth. Yeah. Um, you know what? What's it like collaborating with them, and what does that add to Whipster sure. that you know filmmakers or people would benefit from using? Absolutely. Well, the product that we've built, we're we're a user experience company. We're we're very we index very high on design and user experience. If you think about product design, for anyone out there who's interested in product design, we view it as an iceberg. So above the water, you have the UI. That's what you see, and you're like, oh, a lot of UIs look the same. Below is user experience, and that's what takes years to get right, and a, a product can look great, and it's impossible to use. Our product, thankfully, looks great and is easy to use because we've spent so much time making it work. When we work with Microsoft, what they do is because we're so good at user experience and they're so good at back-end technology, they're able to offer us services that can accelerate us. For example, they've got a whole lot of new work happening with AI tagging. So filmmakers who use our products in the next few months will start to be able to get tags of everything that's happening in their videos inside Webster and be able to search by them. They can then look through their library of a few thousand videos and search for a certain thing. Oh, all the videos with Brad Pitt in it. They all turn up, then you can download, do a re-edit, upload again. So things like that is why we're working very closely with Microsoft. So Rolo, I know you just uh, you know announced the audio feature here. Yeah. Um, you know when does it start to become available, and is that like a, a price upgrade? You know, how, what does it cost the filmmakers to get it, and when can they get sure. it? So it's going to be in your hot little hands in the next couple of weeks, and it's going to be part of your subscription. 
So whatever you have right now, whatever plan you're on, whether you're on enterprise or whether you're on the freelance account, it'll be available and it'll pop up and it'll have a little how-to uh, and then you'll be able to just start going. You know, to give us a ballpark for the freelance level, how much does that cost filmmakers? Sure. Anywhere between $100 and $1,000 per, per year, depending on how many team members you have and how much storage you want. Um, so it's a pretty affordable package if you're doing a ton of videos.